Welcome to the Great Ocean Road, a winding 243 kilometers masterpiece along Victoria's rugged southwest coast. But did you know that this breathtaking drive is more than just a scenic route? Let's dive into its fascinating history. Picture this: 1919, fresh from the trenches of the Western Front, 3,000 returned servicemen gather. They dream of connecting coastal towns, but not just any road. They envision a memorial, a tribute to their fallen comrades. Carved from wild cliffs overlooking the Southern Ocean, the Great Ocean Road becomes their canvas. These men, once warriors, now engineers, wielded picks and shovels. Their sweat and determination etched this road into history. But why this road? Australia faced a dilemma with 350,000 men returning from war. How would they reintegrate into society? The Great Ocean Road was born out of fear, a fear of civil unrest, of dissatisfied men roaming the streets. William Calder, chairman of the Country Roads Board, proposed the South Coast Road, private endeavor with a public purpose. It would link Parvan Heads to Warnabool, hugging the coast. But it wasn't just a road; it was a lifeline, a way to avoid social upheaval. The Great Ocean Road became the world's largest war memorial. Each curve, each cliff whispered the names of those lost. It's a reminder of Australian servicemen's sacrifice, our appreciation and the support for their welfare. So, as you drive this winding path, remember, the Great Ocean Road isn't just asphalt and views. It's a tribute, a permanent memorial to courage. resilience and the enduring spirit of those who served the great ocean road a journey through time etched in stone